Welcome to Games and Stuff Studio. I'm Peter. I'm Sue. Today we bring you a how to play of Pan Am the game. We have a bit of an affinity with this game. We try to develop a board game based on air travel ourselves and this game hits the mark as to how we perceived ours might have been. Suffice to say it never made it. Pan Am was the world's first truly global airline. The game takes you from its humble beginnings in 1927 to the retirement of its founder Juan Tripp in 1968. Pan Am was the first airline to connect North and South America by air. Pan Am was also the first to launch commercial airlines across both the Atlantic and Pacific Oceans. And Pan Am was also the first to computerise their booking system and the first to put in service the now super famous uh, jumbo jet, the Boeing 747. Place the game board in your play area and put the two hangers next to the board by the planes area, C. These hangers house four different size planes, the tri-motor, the clipper, the cruisers and the jets. Next we select one random event card from each of the seven decks to create one deck of seven cards. Place them face down in the centre of the board. Shuffle the destination cards and place them face down in the destination area B on the board. Place one card face up in each of the four spaces. Shuffle the directive cards and place them face down in the directive area E. Place the Pan Am route markers, money, stocks and the Pan Am die next to the board. Set aside the stock marker for now. The first event card will set the stock price. Each player takes a player mat in their colour, along with two tri-motor planes, one clipper plane and an income tracker queue. Five airports and in a two-player game, five engineers. The game was designed by Prospero Hall. It was published in 2020 by Funko Games. Uh, two to four players, age 12 plus is the age group, and about 60 minutes. You play as the head of a fledgling airline competing with Pan Am for international air routes. You have two goals during the game, which are to claim routes by placing workers, engineers in this case, to acquire airports, planes, and destinations. The income you earn from operating and selling routes to Pan Am is ultimately how you buy stock. The game is played over seven rounds with varying effects triggered by event cards and the player with the most stock at the end of the game is the winner. Before we show you how the game is played, there are a few things you need to know. There are five different colours of destination cards representing the different regions of the world. There are four different planes, a tri-motor which travels one leg, a clipper which travels two, cruiser which travels three and a jet which travels four. The routes are the lines between cities with a diamond in the centre showing the route's distance. To claim a route you need a plane with a range that matches or exceeds that distance and landing rights in both cities. Landing rights can be gained four different ways. Firstly having an airport of your colour on the city, having the city's destination card, discarding a destination card of the same region or colour or discarding two destination cards of a different region or colour. Each round has four phases the event phase, where we reveal and resolve the next event card. The engineer phase, where players take turns assigning their engineers to the action spaces around the board. The resolution phase, where players gain the benefits of their engineers' actions. And the Pan Am phase, where the Pan Am expands and players earn income. Each player in a two-player game starts with two destination cards, one directive card and $12 and the last person to have flown on an aircraft is the first player. So, as you read in the rules explanation, Sue, the first player is the one who... Flew last. That would be me. Thank you very much, I'll have the first player. I'll take you through to the board now, and we'll check out what's going on. The first thing we do is reveal an event phase. Okay, round one is radio communications. Okay. Each player draws a destination card from the deck. Nice. There's the stock one price me. is five. There's one for you. And there's going to be one expansion of Pan Am during the Pan Am phase. And we'll expa explain that when we get to it. We will. So and you get to place an engineer first. I get to go first with the engineer. All right, I had a little bit of a thought about what I wanted to do based on the cards that are out and the cards I had, destinations I had in my hand. So I'm going after this destination here of Wake. And because I'm first out, I can bid anywhere on this track. Because uh, if you are outbid, you miss out. You don't get another chance. Yeah, there's only room for one on a bidding track. I don't think you're going to outbid me, so I've gone for the zero cost. Because we no. don't have a lot of money to start I'm not with. really interested in that. Okay. I just um, checked. I don't have any money. Oh, get $12. Yeah. Starting money of $12. 
That was Peter getting himself money and not worrying about me. Oh, you always want me to look after the money, though. <laughs> That's true. <laughs> okay, I'm going to bid three for an airport. Uh, no, Peter's not going for that right now, so I'm not right. too worried about okay. being outbid. Uh, I'm going here in the route. The, the routes and directives um, places your workers can go are unlimited. Unlike the other ones where there's um, money value, uh, you get outbid, your worker comes back to you and you can place it elsewhere or not place. You can. Yeah, you don't have you to place pass, all five you of your engineers if you yeah. don't wish to. Yeah. But I think it would be a waste if you didn't. Okay, your placement. Okay, well I'm going to claim a route as well. Okay. Um, I need more planes, so... Ah. Um, I'm going to get another clipper for $2. Unless you outbid me. Um, I'm just trying to think ahead as to what my next plan would be. But I'm thinking I'm going to go there. I do want one, but I'm going to actually go here and get a tri another tri another tri -motor. Tri motor. I'm going to bid for another card. I'm going to have oh, a crack at Karachi. Really? I wanted Karachi. <laughs> well, you can outbid me. I get that worker back. Correct. Um, and it's my, my placement. In that case, um, I will take Bogota. Mm, interesting. I'm wondering if I should go for Beirut. I do want it in the future, but I don't know if I really want it now. Interesting. But then it... Well, it's going to stay there if nobody bids on it, isn't it? I'm going to go here and get... Get priority access. Get a directive. Yeah, that's what I was planning with my last one. Yes. To get a directive. So, at the end of the resolution phase, we'll each get a directive card. Yes. Which can do various things for you. And you get to place first next and round. That yep. No matter whose turn it is. Yeah. It's... Yes, I even read my directive card. Oh, yeah, I forgot to look at that too. Oh, I could have done oh. that earlier. I I've didn't. got this in the resolution phase anyway, so... Mine was in the event phase. Yeah, I right. didn't do anything. That's all right. Okay. So now it's the resolution phase. Um, and, and you're we, first, because the airports are first. Yeah, we do A, alphabet. Alpha, uh, yeah. <laughs> we do <laughs> alphabet. Your so first resolution. I pay $3 to place an airport. Okay. Where are you placing your airport, sir? Um, I had two thoughts on this, but I think I'm going to go and place it in San Juan. Ooh. Or New York. Hmm. I'm going to go New York. Okay. So now I have landing rights in Miami and New York. Nice. Nice. Um, I am next in B, so I get... Bogota. Bogota for zero. Excellent. And I get Wake for zero. And unfortunately, I have to pay two for Karachi. Um, next is C, Planes. You get a trimotor for nothing. Yay. Uh, a little, no, a tri yes, a trimotor. Yes, a trimotor. A little trimotor. Yeah. And I get a clipper for two dollars. That's one of the cool things on this, because we were like, they're very similar in looking at the planes, but they actually have little marks on their wings that tell you the distance they yes, travel. Yes, they do. So the tri motors have, um, have one and the clippers have two. The other interesting thing we haven't pointed out is the board, the map, is a top-down view from essentially the North Pole, uh, which is quite an it's interesting a, per perspective to have on the map. Yeah. Um, next is routes. And you're first. I'm first. Take that claim, back. Claim, claim, claim route. <laughs> I am claiming Guam to Wake cool. with a... I have Guam and Wake, both cards. Yep. I keep those. You don't discard them. I don't yes. discard them. And I place my plane on there. And because it's a two, it's a... It's a two. So you get a clipper. income of two. I now have income of two on my board. So as you claim routes, you... Advance your income for the income phase. And once, what we didn't do it right when we first played it is once you sell a route back to Pan Am, you'll then lose you that lose that income, yep. which is fair. All right, you're Okay, next. so I am going from Miami. 
to New York with one of my little tri-motors. Oh, so right. I get one. That was really exciting. And you have Miami? You have the card Miami? I have the card Miami. And you Miami. have the airport in New York. Well done. Okay. And now I get a directive card. And I get a directive. Ooh. Ooh, cool. Another one for the event phase for me. That's not a bad thing. I'm interested as to how that works, but... Now those ones stay there? Yep. For the next round. For the next round. So, uh, routes, directives. Next is the Pan Am expansion. Yes. Now according to the event phase, there is only one expansion signified by the dice on the uh, card. I don't know if you can see that in the overhead. And we roll the dice, and it has two tracks on it, which is the dotted track and the square track, which shows where Pan yeah, Am goes from. Yeah, so there's from. a triangle track, a square track, which is the one I'm on, and the dotted track. So, so Pan Am expands, expands there and Miami buys expands. you out straight away. And buys me out. And I, over here, I have a one route, so I get $5. You get $5. And you get your plane back. But I lose my income. Yes, you've lost that income. Um, doesn't affect me, the Pan Am expansion. So now you get income. Now I get income, I get an income of you two You get two dollars. That was quite good. Okay. Okay. That is the end of round one. Pull All back right. the rest, oh they stay there. They stay there. So now we're on to, do you want to replace the destination cards? I will replace cards? the destination cards. And now we're on to round two. So we're not going to play this to uh, end game, we're just going to show... Um, A few turns. Three turns each. All right, round two is the Trans-Pacific Push. At the start of the expansion phase, Pan Am expands once along the Asian Pacific path. Ooh, first. So it, it's already telling you. Does that mean you don't roll it? Oh, no, it does it first, and then you roll. And then you roll. Ah, uh, okay. okay. And the stock price goes down to four. So the oh, and we were allowed to buy stock at the end oh, of yes, the game, too. We, um, yeah, I was going to do that, I'm too. I'm just not doing that yet. Yeah, I'll, I'll have um, how much have is stock. Stock was five. Stock was five. Um, I'll have one stock. One stock Thank for you. five. At five. This is the winning condition. Yes. Having the most stock. So stock has dropped down to four for the next round. Mm. Okay. Very good. Um, you are first to place. First, I'm. Got any it, we're still in the event phase, so I'm going to play this card, oh. which is a prediction card. Um, which means I earn $3 and I look at the top card of the event deck. Oh, and you get to know what's going on. You get to know so you what's going to happen. You can plan. Especially you, if, you, if the stock's going to go down or it, up. Inside or of whatever. trading. In, in, yeah. <laughs> so I get to look at this one. Oh, that's interesting. And nobody shall be any the wiser. I will put that discard over there. Okay. But I got an extra three bucks for doing that, so that's cool. Nice. So... Right, so now I get to place... Yes, you're first up. I'm first player anyway. Yep. I get to place my worker. Now, I had a plan. But I... might need an airport. But I have a feeling you might need an airport too. So, I'm going to... I'm going to bid five for an airport. <laughs> Knowing that you only have seven dollars, so you could outbid me for an airport. Didn't think your next turn through. There is a little bit of AP in this game. I will grab Bangkok. Bangkok. Actually, I will pay for it because I want to make sure that you don't get it for. Cheap if you try oh, to take it. Loads of money. <laughs> <laughs> you were meant to place that one, but that's all right. Oh yeah, I'll take that one back. Um, oh, Seattle. Let's Seattle. Oh, that would be all right. I could go there. Yeah, I can go there. <laughs> <laughs> I'd like to be able to place two routes, but I don't know if I can. Um, where's Beirut? Oh, it's right at the top. Okay, that's not really helpful. 
Rio de Janeiro, that's down in that bit. Nowhere near. I wish there was a spot where you could grab a destination off the top of the deck. Yeah, that would be nice, but anyway, it comes, up, go it comes up in directives that you get free picks Your turn. top cards. My turn. Um, are we only allowed to go there once each in a two-player? Um, it doesn't actually mention that in the rules. I'm going to have a second directive. Okay. Yeah. That's fine. I don't think I have anything to do with my... Unless I get that. Oh my God, because I've got correct. Yeah, I'm going to go here. Where are you going to go? I'll get Rio. Okay. Okay, we resolve. Right. Another airport. I get an airport. For five bucks. For five bucks. Oh, I didn't really think this through. <laughs> <laughs> you heard it first, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> <laughs> what was I thinking? I should have done two routes. I could have done two routes. Okay. I'm an idiot. Not to worry. It means you can... Yeah, oh, I can set myself up for another one. For another one, yeah. Okay, I'm going to... Oh, you're an idiot, Sue. <laughs> I don't get to say that. <laughs> I'm going to go to San Francisco. Oh, okay. Um, I've got to save myself. Next up I... is B, so you can take your two... My two destination cards. And I'll take my two destinations and my Seattle workers. Seattle and Bay Route. Yellow workers. Uh, you're placing a route first. Yes, I am, and I'm claiming Calcutta to Bangkok, up here. I have both cities. Calcutta and, and it's a, to Bangkok, it's a one. It's a one, so my income goes up by one. I, Lovely, yep. okay. You're next, take that back. Okay, um, I'm claiming San Francisco to Seattle, which is a one. Nice, now we do directives. Yes. I get one. Yep. And I get one. Mm. Right. Cool. Okay. That's. I can play this straight handy. away. Is it in the resolution phase? Mm. Yeah, I can too, but it doesn't do me any good right now. Might be a bit early to do that, so I might save that. <laughs> uh, you've got one, and I get another one. I only took one. Yeah. So, okay. Okay. Um, I forgot to do one. Got to remember these directives. Yeah. Got to remember these yeah. directives. All right, that's the end of round two. Now we do uh, the Pan Am phase. Now, they've got to go once in the Asian Pacific path. So that's this way, yeah? Yep. Um, it is, isn't it? Yes. The triangles. The triangles. So it goes there. Yeah. And now we roll the die. I'll roll that. So what we get? We get the circles. And triangles. And triangles again. So that's another one on the Asia Pacific. And this one over here, between San Juan and Port of Spain. Very nice. Okay. Um, that is the end of the expansion phase. Now we do income. I get three. And then we three. can buy stock. Yeah. You get three. I get one. That's exciting. And we can buy stock. I'm buying two. Two? I'm buying Ooh, two. Wow, you jumped ahead of me. That is the end of round two. Right. Uh, for round three, the cruisers are now opened up Yay. to bid on. This card gets removed, the cruiser type, gets put to one side. Uh, so now we can bid on cruisers, which are slightly bigger planes, which allow us to do longer routes. Yeah. Yeah, cool. So do you want to put out some new destination cards? put out some cards? new destinations. You can get the, um, the event card. The thing I already know what it says. Oh, yeah. <laughs> 
Round three is the crisis of war. Oh, shoot. Income is doubled this round. Oh, really? But stock price goes up to five. Okay. And there are two expansions. Two expansions. At the well, Pam's nowhere near me. I'm miles away. Yeah, okay. <laughs> this is a problem. Uh, I am first place, yeah? Yeah, you are. So they're used, they're used. No, they're not used. They're used. I think as long as you're using the um, directive space, this doesn't really have any bearing. No. <laughs> on oh, what's in a multiplayer game. In a multiplayer it would, it would yes. You would get priority and then you'd go to player one. Yeah. Yeah, in a four player. In our well, if you're a player one as well, you get to go twice. Ah, oh, yeah. Yeah. So I do I'm get to go twice. Fine. Priority. Whatever. Um Right. No, but my guy has priority second. Where is Bathurst? There. Okay. Uh, this guy. Getting an airport this time around. You think? Yep. Yeah. Oh, we've missed something. What's that? Um, we were meant to get income for airports. Okay. Now, so you don't have any on the board. I don't have any I have on the two, board. So, three, so I should have got another two dollars for having the airports. You would have got three dollars because you had an airport out in round one. So another dollar. Okay. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Um, that solves that. It's no, still your yes. turn. Okay. Okay. Right. Um, Bathurst, Hong Kong, New Delhi. Ooh. Let's go for New Delhi. Hmm. Okay. You've got another priority. Yeah. Uh, I'm going for Hong Kong. Sorry, I can do that. So. You're going to build a route definitely first? Definitely going to build a route. I'm going to build a route. Um, I'm trying to work out if I can get two done, but I don't think I can. I need a little one job. A one jobby? Yep, I need a little one. A little one jobby. But the card that I want is not out. And I don't really want to bid for an airport because I don't have enough money. So I think I'm just going to go for the directive. Oh, I know what I could do, yeah. Okay, your turn. <laughs> He's secretly planning something. Okay. Um, I'm going to get a cruiser. Oh. So I'm going to need bigger planes as I expand. It's funny you should say that. I'm going to get a clipper. Okay. <laughs> um, I'm, oh, I don't, yeah. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> really? I will get Port of Spain. Oh, I thought you were interested in Bathurst. Well, it, yes and no. Mm. But, okay. Yeah. It's a bit far away it, from it's Paris, not really isn't it? lining up with, with other things at the moment, so no, mm. I'm not I doing that. I don't really that. want Bathurst. Hmm. Can I do that more than once, or is that just a one-off? Oh, these are, the directors are once-off. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Damn. You know what? <gasps> Double directives. Double directives. Right. Oh. <laughs> okay, no, that's we're fine. up to the resolution phase. We're up to the resolution and you phase. are first I'm up. first. I'm getting an airport. For $3. I've got to remember where I put, I'm putting it. <laughs> Forgotten <laughs> where I'm putting it. Um, yeah, that's right. Manila. Manila? Yeah. Okay. Um, I knew I wanted to claim two routes and I forgot to do it. But... Um, what's the next phase? Pla destinations, isn't it? B. Yep. Right. So I'm getting New Delhi. Yep. And you are getting Hong Kong and Port of Spain. And none of us have to pay anything. You okay? Yes. <laughs> I'm getting a little bit AP'd. 
Okay, yeah. Getting a little bit AP'd. It's a surprising amount of that in his game. Okay, um, that stays there for now. Planes. Planes. Uh, I'm paying $4. For a cruiser. Oh, I'm running out of money. Yeah, that happens. For a cruiser. And you are paying $2. Two dollars for a clipper. For a in, clipper in yellow. There you go. And I'm playing my directive card. Now I am doing, which is upgrade upgrade a plane in your fleet. So I'm upgrading the clipper that I just bought. Yep. To a cruiser. I can reach one. I am in the plane phase. I am allowed to sell a plane in my stash for four dollars. So I'm selling a oh, wow. trimotor for four dollars. Wow. And that's card is spent. That's pretty cool. Thank you. Okay, um, so now I have two tri-motors, a clipper and a cruiser. And we're up to roots. So okay. I'm building my route first. Mm -hmm. I have Seattle, so I have landing rights in Seattle and I have an airport in New York. So okay. I'm going here with my cruiser Yep. for three. One, two, three. Okay. shouldn't have sold my plane. <laughs> <laughs> I shouldn't have sold my plane. Anyway, I'm claiming from Guam, because I have landing rights there, to Manila, where Very I put good. an airport. So did you get one income for your airport? One and two, and for, two for your cool. route. That's nice. Excellent. So that was that. I have the ability. To. But I don't have a plane to do it with, so I'm going to save it. Um, I can claim an additional route. Oh. But I don't know with this card if I need landing rights. I would think you do. Okay, we'll play it like that, that's fine. Um, okay, that is the end of my routes. Okay, so I get two directives. You get two directives, I don't get any. Mm. <laughs> I'm a bit left out. And I get to have two goes. I'm a bit phone first. now. Ooh, what have we got? <laughs> I got two of the same card. That's awesome. I like that. Okay. Good-o. Sue is having a good time now. Um, having a very good time. So we're up to the expansion phase for Pan Am. Oh, it's going to expand it's Double expansion. Uh, squares and triangles. Squares and triangles. Okay, so it's going here and it's going to There. Bermuda. Yeah, sorry. Yes, New York to Bermuda. Ooh. There's a hair on the board. <laughs> That's really annoying. Okay. Okay, now um, it expands again. It expands again. It's Pan Am. So oh. they can buy... Any route in the do world. Do they buy them all? Or you, you can, can sell? You can sell. You can sell to them. One route. One. To Pan Am. Ooh, do I want to? You can go first if you want to. I might as well, hey? Yeah. Okay, so because I'm selling a three route, I get $12 for that. Okay. So firstly I'll take this back and I'll go one, two, three backwards. Get your 12 bucks. Get my 12 bucks. I am going to sell a two route to them. For nine. For nine, I'll go backwards two. Thank you. And that is the end of the, now we do the income phase. That's the expansion phase. So now we get our income. I get four. You get four. Yeah. Can I give you a five? Yes, definitely. And I'll have Take one, one back. And I get three. Which is fine. And the stock. Uh, yes, I'm going to buy some stock. What stocks? What stock level? Five. five. I'll have two stock, please. Certainly. Thank you. Ten dollars. All right. Um, refresh the board. I am also going to buy two. Oh, okay. 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 All good. Um, round four. Oh, it's round six. That yeah, that comes off, off in round, comes six. Off round six. So new destinations. Does that get flushed? No, I don't think so. It stays There's there. nothing about flushing. Okay. Uh, new. 
Okay, round four is round the world service. Each player earns one dollar. Hang on, I'm just thinking. Your income was doubled that round, oh. so I actually got six. I should have got eight. So I have another four, thanks. You have another four. Gee. And I get another three. Now, round four. Round the world service. Each player earns one dollar for each route they currently have claimed. We earn that now? Yep. It's immediate. One, two claims. You get two dollars. Yep. $2. And I get a whole one dollar. All right, and the stock price goes up one. Oh God, it's up to six. Okay. And there's two expansions this Double round. Double expansion, right. You are first, first I... player. You get to go twice straight off the bat. Yay. Um, I think I need an airport. <laughs> um, I want to do... You've got plenty of planes. Hmm. I know, but it's places that I want. Oh, I should do that. That's a good idea. I'm going to go for an airport. Hopefully don't get outbid, but... <laughs> it's my turn again. Yes, it is. For route. Me? Yep. Okay. Money bags. Um... Look at all that money. <laughs> <laughs> Don't know what I'm doing. You lost your engineers? I'm going to get a tri-motor. Really? Yep. Okay. Need a one route, do you? Yep. Hmm. Didn't have to use that, but I could use that again. Hmm. All right, what have we got up there? Karachi, Beirut, that's a three. Can't do that. I feel AP setting in. Yeah, <laughs> it is, yeah, very, very much. I just don't have the one I want. Oh, this is a bit frustrating now. New York, well that's useless. I already own the airport there. So I'm going to go bid $4 oh, a bid on a cruiser. $4 for a cruiser. Nice. I'm going to climb around. Okay. Can I do another one? You can get three airports out of them. Wow. You can all your airports. Well, you, you did airports in the last game we played. I wish I could get two airports out there. <laughs> you can't. You I can can't only have, have one. Them. Okay. can them. I can only have one. I'm going to go for Honolulu. Honolulu. That's a pretty good one to pick, actually, because you're yeah. right there. That's yeah. very good. I'm going to go for a directive. Okay. I will also you will also go for a directive. directive. Um, no, I won't. No, you won't. No, I'm going to go for another route. Two, two, two routes. Um, Right, two workers to place. Mm, I'm in trouble. I'm in trouble. Um, sorry, but I'm going to outbid you for home. <gasps> I can have that back. You can have that one back. You can choose to outbid me again. How much money have I got? And you have. Oh, you've gone all the way to the top. Okay, all right. Well, I don't need two Port of Spains, so I won't be getting that. Um, I will go for pa a Bathurst then, because I'm kind of over there, but not really. Kind I'll work of. Some, I'll work something out. <laughs> <laughs> Fudge it. <laughs> <laughs> Setting up for next round, which will be our last round. I don't think anyone fudges airline routes, do they? <laughs> All right, are we up to the resolution phase now? Or you've still got an engineer? I've still got an engineer. Look, um, I might as well get another directive. Okay. I'm unsure that we're meant to do that, I think. Yeah, I, well, I, there's I, a few things that are. Yeah. we're a little bit unsure about, but that's okay. All right, so I'm paying $3 for an airport. Right. 
and I am going to put that in midway. Yes, midway, which gives me one income. B. I get Bathurst. And apparently I'm paying six now for Honolulu. Yes. Expensive card. B. Nothing in. Oh, B. No Pay zero for one bid this phase. So uh, I can have a card without. Okay. Yeah. Go for it. Uh, I don't know if any of them were any use for, to you, yeah, really. Hawks out of play. Pause. No, I don't need it, so I won't do it. I'll save that for another time. Okay, we're up to planes. Up to planes. You get a clipper for four, a cruiser for four. Oh, God, that's all my money. You need to sell some planes. <laughs> and I get a tri-motor for zero. My fleet is a bit crowded in the hangar here. Uh, now we are up to... Now we're up to here. Routes, you go first. All right. Got this sussed. So I now have rights in Honolulu and San Francisco. So I'm doing that route with a cruiser for three. And then it's your turn. Okay. Taking that back. Uh, I'm claiming uh, I've already claimed Hong Kong to Manila. Uh, what was I claiming? Oh, no, you haven't. No, I haven't. That's what I was doing. That's, That's what, what I was you doing did? last night. Okay. Hong Kong to Manila gives me an additional income of one. Okay, so I'm claiming another route, which is Honolulu to Midway. Nice. With my clipper. For two. And I have... The ability here, when resolving your engineer, claim a free route with a distance of one. Oh. What I don't understand about that card is, do I need landing rights? Because they're all free when you've got the landing rights. Hmm. That's an interesting card, that one. Hmm. It needs more information, doesn't it? Needs it? more information. So I am going to claim a free yeah, route just, of one. Yeah. Are you going to go to Saigon? And I'm going to go... Not that you have to do anything in a line. And I'm using a bigger plane than I need, but I'm going there. And I get an income of okay. one on top of that. Okay. Okay. That's interesting, because I have landing rights in Saigon. Mm. But you haven't used it? No, I haven't used it. Okay. Uh, that is... So we're up to the directive, up to the so you get to take two cards. Event phase, which is... At the beginning. At the beginning. And end of game. Oh. I haven't seen an end of game. I have an end of game. So me first. Yep. Now, I had a plan. Hang on. Pan Am phase. Oh, Pan Am phase. Sorry. Pan -am yes, Pan Am phase. Yes. phase. Um, two so expansions. Two expansions. Okay. I'm it ready. is circles and triangles. Circles and... Oh, triangles. You're getting a route of so three. So that's twelve dollars for me. To you. Nice. And my income goes back three. One, two, three. I have an income. That's uh, that's the first uh, expansion. Th there's two expansions this game. Circles and triangles again. Oh. <sighs> so it's claiming this route off me oh, as look well. Oh, you. So my income goes down. Two, but I claim nine dollars. Another nine dollars. You're all cashed up again. <laughs> uh, income phase. Six dollars, please, for me. And during the Pan Am phase, I get to sell one of my routes to Pan Am. So I'm going to sell this little guy here back to Pan Am for five dollars. Right, now income. How much did you get? Six, please. Six dollars. Now I'm going to buy some stock. Yeah, and mine stock is... Stock is at six? Four dollars. One, two, three, four. I'll have two stock, please. Two stock. Twelve dollars. 
thank you very much. Right. I am going to have mm. two destinations. I'm going to buy three. Three stock? Yeah. Wow, I think you're ahead of me. Anyway, we're not going to play this game to uh, its completion. You're just going to have to play it for yourselves to find out <laughs> how it wins. <laughs> this will be... <laughs> we'll call it, call it there? Yeah. We'll call it there. We'll probably keep going. So playing, that, but... that, we may. <laughs> um, but that's how it's played. Um, it's... It's quite nice. It is quite nice. Um, but we'll give you a review we shortly will. after this. But you, 